Wind energy is the fastest growing sector of renewable energy production. However, limitations of turbine tower height and intermittent wind conditions at low altitudes are major hurdles to competitive pricing with fossil fuel energy production. Beginning in the mid-1970s, NASA led the technology development of utility-scale kilowatt-towered wind turbines. This has evolved to the megawatt-scale commercial wind turbines that you see in use today. NASA Langley Research Center has begun research into a new field of renewable energy called airborne wind energy. This new method of harnessing the wind's power will enable access to the faster, steadier winds at higher altitudes. This is a ground-based, reel-out, reel-in generator system. A small, 2-kilowatt generator airborne wind energy research platform has been built and is being used to perform basic research on flight dynamics, automated control, and improved aerodynamics for this new technology. This platform integrates existing, off-the-shelf technologies to enable this new method. The wing is flown in a high-speed figure-eight pattern to maximize tension on the tethers during the reel-out power generation phase. When the maximum tether length is reached, a low-tension recovery reel-in is used. The difference between reel-out energy and reel-in energy is positive. Airborne wind energy is well suited for offshore application due to the simplification in deep sea floor anchoring. Other proposed applications include military forward operating sites and disaster relief sites. NASA Langley is also developing other airborne wind energy concepts for robotic exploration of Mars. In this flying generator concept, a buoyant vehicle tethers itself to the Mars surface. Martian winds turn electric turbine generators to charge onboard batteries. When the batteries are charged, the vehicle untethers itself and uses the turbine generator in propeller motor mode for exploration in the lower atmosphere of Mars. We anticipate that the development of these new technologies will enable the next generation of commercial wind power.